Hey, what's up everybody? My name is David Aryev and I'm a 3D generalist and freelancer and I guess I'm well known for creating overly ambitious full CG music video projects that I get in way over my head on as well as working for artists like Dead Mouse and Katy Perry doing their concert visuals and making Octane tutorials. But the thing I'm here to talk to you about today is Aaron's amazing VFX crash course which I super love because Unlike a lot of other tutorials that are just focused on button pushing or learning a specific piece of software and all of the different menu options and stuff like that, his focuses on a whole workflow or a mindset. And that mindset is taking a shot all the way from the start to finish, concept to completion, and doing that regardless of the software. Basically, whatever the tool is for the job, using that to get the job done. So he starts with creating like a gorgeous matte painting in Photoshop, doing all the color matching and stuff, then going into C4D and adding in some geometry and lighting and whatnot and rendering out an animatic. And that animatic looks pretty good, like something that you could post to Instagram and be happy with. But then that is actually just a tool to show the client like what the general direction of the shot is. And from there, he tears it all down because they go in and they do a full VFX supervised shoot and the lighting and the actor are somewhat different than what was expected and it generates some new ideas. And so from there, he builds it back up so much better with a new matte painting and a fully sculpted environment in 3D coat. And that, by the way, was a mind blowing part of the course for me because I'd never seen much 3D coat stuff before. And it just shows how deep and powerful that program is. And then from there, he goes into C4, back into C4D, does projection man workflow with, uh, you know, his new map painting that he creates from scratch and then into both Octane and Redshift. And with both of those, he's got a totally different shot. He's got a very different shot in Octane from Redshift. So if you watch the whole course, every single video, you'll get something different from each one of those workflows. And you'll also see like and be able to compare and contrast the difference between those two render engines. Then the same thing goes with Fusion and Nuke. He shows how to do compositing in both of those pieces of software and uses a different shot for each one, one with a forest and one with um, kind of a desert landscape. And both of them look great in their own right. But so you're learning just more and more and seeing how you can do similar things in different pieces of software, but also showing you the strengths of each piece of software so that you can figure out which one is right for you. Anyway, I love the course and I hope you'll check it out. See you later.